Hello, this is Francisco Cribari and um, this video is about a problem I've been having with uh, Darktable, the software I use to edit my images, my RAW and JPEG files. Basically the problem is that um, when I import an old folder into Darktable, that is a folder that contains photos I made and edited using Darktable several months ago, the XMP files that contain the edits that I made back then are overwritten by new, fresh XMP files. And then I lose all of my previous edits and the solution is to go to a second external hard drive, copy the old XMP files into the folder that I've just imported, and then import the folder again. As you can see, I'm running the unstable version of Darktable from Pascal's PPA, and uh, my computer is a standard uh, Ubuntu 14.04 notebook. The file system I run is X4, XT4. Uh, here are my settings, my dark table settings. Nothing unusual, I think. Here is the core options. Nothing unus unusual. I have not changed anything in those three fields here and uh, let's see what happens uh, I'm gonna I keep all of my files my raw and JPEG files in an external hard drive and uh, I import the folders that I need to import into Darktable this is the hard drive where I keep my files, my photos, and the second one is the hard drive that I use to back up the first external hard drive. So I have two external hard drives here. So let's go to photos made in on uh, November 21st, 2012 that's the, f the folder here so that's where my files are so let's take a look at uh, the raw XMP files so here are the raw XMP files and there are a bunch of JPEG files and some raw files in this folder and as you can see they date back to November 25th in 2012. So let's go and let's import that folder into Darktable. And 2012, November and uh, 21st. So let's import that. That's the folder I'm going to import into Darktable. And what's going to happen, I believe, is that uh, those XMP files are going to be overwritten with new ones with no edits, just the basic uh, zero original, one sharpen orientation and base curve. And then all my edits are gone. Let's, let's uh, go ahead. So I have a bunch of JPEG files and in interestingly the problem doesn't happen with uh, the JPEG files. It only happens to my raw files. I don't lose the edits that I made to JPEG files. That's quite interesting. And, uh, and I have no idea what's causing that. Uh, I did uh, remove my library DB file and the problem uh, remained. So look at here, look at these JPEG files jpeg file i open the jpeg file i have all of my edits here in the history field if i open the raw file 
my previous edits are gone. I only have this standard stuff here. Let's uh, ls again. As you can see, the XMP files that I had that dated back to November 25th, November 28th and so on, now are overwritten with new XMP files that date to July 11th, oh, that is today. And, uh, and then I lose all my edits, all the edits that I made to the raw files. And that's a problem, especially in folders where mo I have mostly have uh, uh, raw files. Look at here, no, no edits here in the history field, and so on, and so on, and so on. And then, what, um, what do I do at this point? What do I do at this point? I go to my second hard drive. That's the hard drive where, where I, that I use to backup my files. That's the, this one here. And I go there, uh, November 21st, and then I find the NAF XMP files. And then I copy these files into the first external hard drive, that's the hard drive that I, my primary external hard drive. And then I come here and I'm gonna copy those files and I'm gonna overwrite the XMP files that Darktable just created with the ones that I have in my backup hard drive. And after I backup, I copy those files from my backup hard drive I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna import the same folder again I'm gonna import the same folder again let's go 11 uh, November 11 uh, the 21st I'm gonna import the same folder again and then let me see if did import the folder yeah, it's important, 48 images, and then, now, I, I, this is the raw file that I opened, and I lost all of my edits. As you can see, the edits now are going to be back, and uh, I, not only the edits, the tags, and the stars, the ratings, and so on. I'm going to open the same file that I opened a couple minutes ago, and that I had no edits for it. So that's the raw file. And now I have all of my, the edits that I made back then are here. And I only have, I only get those edits back after I copy the XMP files corresponding to my raw files from the second hard drive, that is from the backup hard drive. Interestingly, that doesn't affect the, that doesn't happen to my JPEG files, only to raw files, and and that only happens to folders that I have not used for several months. I have no idea what's going on. I have nothing. I have no weird configuration in my notebook. I run a pretty standard, uh, a pretty vanilla uh, Ubuntu install, uh, and I have no idea what's going on. So let's do another LS. And uh, that's what's happened. I have no idea what's going on, and uh, I hope someone can figure out what's happening. And let me know what I should try and what I should do. Thank you.